What's going on everybody? Tactical Production 7 here, back with the Minecraft mod tutorial. Today's mod tutorial will be on the paintball mod, and what this mod does is it adds paintball guns to Minecraft. It adds five different types of paintball guns, as well as armor and a grenade and claymore. You can also build a base by placing a certain block down and right clicking it and it will automatically create the base. And there's also a scanner plate, which I'll show you what that does. So if I go ahead and hit E to open up my inventory, I can show you I have the armor on. And this was the scanner plate I was talking about. And again, I'll show you what that does in a little bit. But we have the pistol, shotgun, rifle, sniper, launcher, and then we have the grenade, the claymore, and then the paintball pellets itself, and then the um, insta base, which will create your base. So when you have the gun, if you left click, it will bring up your iron sights and you can aim and then you of course you right click to shoot and that's what they look like when they're in the ground here's just all the different guns some shoot faster than the others this is the sniper rifle, let me see if I can get that pig right there There we go. One shot and he's done. And then we have the launcher. Which is pretty cool. It shoots a uh, grenade. I just wasted my grenade using that. And then we have the claymore. As soon as you set that down, walk in front of it, it blows up. Let me go ahead and grab myself another grenade since I used that one on accident. Okay and then you have the grenade and you just throw it and there you go so now I'll go ahead and show you the insta base so if we set this down and then like I said right click it there we go it's created the base and now I'll show you what the plates do or the scanners so let me go ahead and give myself a door and a scanner so if I set the door down it will create a door then we have the scanner and what this does is if you have blue armor on, it'll allow you to press this plate and open the door. But if we have a red scanner, let me go ahead and remove this. And since I have blue armor on, when I step on the plate, it will not open it because I do not have red armor on to activate this pressure plate. So that is what the scanner is. It's so the enemy cannot get into your base. And inside the base, we just have your furnace, your crafting table, and then all of the um, weapons and armor, and as well as some bullets. So that is what the paintball mod adds to Minecraft. So I now need to clean out Minecraft jar. After I do that, I'll be back and I'll show you how to install this. Alright, so what you're going to need to install this mod is some sort of archiving program, such as WinRAR, 7-Zip, or WinZip. All these archiving programs do work the same so you can use whatever you prefer I will be using WinRAR in this tutorial then you're going to need to download audio mod, mod loader, mod loader MP and the paintball mod itself so to get all these files I'll go ahead and give you the link to these three pages in the description so first off for the paintball mod what we want to do is scroll down to the table of contents and you can see that it shows you all the recipes and pretty much all the information on the mod but what we want to do is go ahead and click on downloads and then go ahead and click on client files and you bring it over to an ad fly and you wait five seconds and up in the top right hand corner it will say skip ad and a big yellow button as soon as you click on skip ad it will automatically download the mod now for audio mod and mod letter if we go ahead and come over to Rezagami's mods and scroll down until we see mod letter 1.1 we can either do download ad fly or download direct whatever you prefer to do I usually tend to do direct because then I can just download it straight from this, from this page and not have to worry about ad fly so after you download mod letter, go ahead and scroll down a little bit more until you see audio mod 1.1 and again you can either do download from AdFly or direct whatever you prefer to do. Now when you're ready to download mod letter MP, go ahead and come over to Flans Mods and go down to the table of contents and go ahead and click on mod letter MP and that'll bring us down here and you want to make sure you're downloading the client version and not the server version and you can either download it from AdFly or Mediafire, whatever you prefer to do so that is how you download everything that you're going to be installing so when you're ready to install it go ahead and come over to start then type in percent app data percent 
just like this down here then go ahead and open up your roaming then open your dot minecraft now open your bin and left click your minecraft jar then right click it and do open with and select whatever archiving program you're using I'm using WinRAR so I'm gonna go ahead and open it with WinRAR now your bin we will be coming back to this later on in the tutorial so go ahead and minimize this for now do not close it so once you have your minecraft jar open go ahead and open up audio mod highlight these three files and drag them into your minecraft jar and hit ok go ahead and close audio mod open up mod loader and highlight all these class files and drag them into your minecraft jar and hit ok go ahead and close mod loader now open up mod loader mp and highlight all these class files and drag them into your minecraft jar and hit ok now you can go ahead and close mod loader mp and in your minecraft jar you should see a folder called metainf if you do not see this folder it's okay you can go ahead and just skip this step but if you do see it what you want it to do is delete it so go ahead and left click it then right click it select delete files hit yes and there you go that deletes metainf you want to make sure you always delete metainf when you're installing a mod if you don't it'll cause minecraft to possibly get a black screen and crash so once you delete metainf go ahead and close your minecraft jar now you should have minimized your bin so bring that back up and go ahead and hit back so we're back in the dot minecraft folder and now open up the paintball mod and highlight these two folders and drag them into your dot minecraft and hit yes and there you go you're done installing the paintball mod so hope this video helped you guys out thank you for watching and i will see you guys next time